Hello, this is Alex Eames from Raspi.tv. Today we're having a look at the Quick2Wire interface board. This is a beta version, which means it's still in testing and not released to the public yet. I thought we'd start by showing it in action, and then have a little guided tour around the board. It's a breakout board for the Raspberry Pi that provides eight buffered and protected general purpose input-output ports, two serial parallel interface ports, and one I2C port, as well as UART for serial connection. So let's have a little guided tour around the board. Here you've got the main socket where it connects to the GPIO ports. Here you've got an array of diodes which protects the eight GPIO ports which are broken out over here in this female header. Uh, those are also protected by these 330 ohm resistors. Uh, over here we've got a regulator which gives you a 3V3 voltage supply on this pin and over here as well. Uh, here you've got an LED which is connected to one of the ports and you've also got a push button which is connected to another port. You can enable and disable those connections with jumpers. You see one's attached, one isn't. So the LED is disabled at the moment, but the button is enabled. You've also got two other jumpers on the board. One here for enabling and disabling the SPI interface, and another one over here for enabling and disabling the I2C interface. Um, what else have we got? So here is the SPI interface and there's another one over here, so you've got SPI0, SPI1 and over here you've got I2C interface. Now there's an I2C expansion board and I'll just connect things up and zoom out a bit and then you'll be able to see. It's the I2C expansion board which I have only just built and haven't had a chance to play with yet. But I'm including it here so you can see how the whole system goes together. Let's just zoom out a bit more and you'll see. There you go. So you've got, ultimately you'll have a Raspberry Pi and then a interface board and then the expansion board. So let's now finish by zooming in on the RGB color changing LED for a closer look. This is controlled with a Python 3 script using the quick to wire Python API. This was Alex Eames for Raspi.tv. Thank you for watching.